Hey, good morning, everybody. This is Pastor JC coming at you live this morning out on the river here in Titusville. I am uh, out on my kayak just enjoying a little bit of time of refreshing and restoration. And you know, as I was thinking about that this morning, I, I thought about when Christ was on this earth and there were many times that he was engaged in ministry. He was doing the work of the kingdom. He was busy. He was teaching. He was healing. He was he was providing. He was breaking bread. He was teaching. He was imparting wisdom one on one to people like Nicodemus and others who came to him. And I, I thought about that. There were other times that Jesus took his core group, his twelve disciples. And he said, let's get away. And they'd go to the mountain, or they'd get on a boat, and they'd launch out into the deep, and they would get away from the crowd so that he could have some time of refreshing and restoring. And I, I thought about that in, in our lives. You know, there are times when we get so caught up in what we're doing, whether it's taking care of our family or paying the bills or working our job or even doing the really good things like ministry and church and serving and and all of those things, we can get so caught up in that, that we completely empty our well, and we have nothing left to give. And Jesus understood the importance of taking that time sometimes to get away so that he could be restored and refreshed. And I'm so thankful for that. You know, he even built it into the creation when he created the world, because he created everything in six days, and then he rested. Psalmist David had a pretty good grasp of this when he spoke in Psalm chapter 23 and he talked about the shepherd and what the shepherd does for us. And he's, one of the things that he says is he restores my soul. He, le he causes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He brings me to those moments of refreshment and rest and times when my soul is reinvigorated and revived and brought back to life. Listen, you can't pour out of an empty pitcher. You can't get water out of an empty well. And if you're not taking time for yourself at times to step back and let the shepherd restore your soul, then you're missing an important part of life and the process that God has placed in, in this world. I mean, everything happens in seasons. And, and so I want to encourage you today, take some time, even if it's just an hour to get away and meditate and, and pray and spend time with the Lord, even if it's just an hour to break free or two hours or maybe half a day or a whole day, just to spend some time and allow him to refresh your soul and restore your soul. I promise you, you won't regret it. I'm out here on the river and before I crash this thing into this island that I'm headed to, <laughs> I'm going to get off of here, but we have a launch happening here in an hour or so and I'm hoping to be out here on the river when the launch happens. That would be awesome. I love you all. I'm praying for you. May God bless you today. Take care of yourselves.